Okay, so this is how to replace uh, flow talk to um, prop. So we basically got we have to clean all the old Mercury 24C off first, and then put that one in. And then we put on some more 24C. And you can also use Mercury's prop version for this, um, but the 24C works equally well. And we basically just smear it all in place. Once we have enough 24C on, then we take the prop, and the prop is a 15 pitch, um, and that's where the flow talk hub goes in. So I have my flow talk hub here, and I can slide it into the prop. So now that we have the prop shaft greased up, we take the propeller and in this case it's a 15P, 15 pitch um, standard flow talk hub and hub kit. And if this hub kit ever gets stuck, um, you can basically reverse this and basically punch it out. So that prevents it from getting stuck. So anyway, we have the standard prop, we take the hub kit slide it into the prop casing so that fits in nicely you can just tap it a little bit to get it to fit so we just tap it once or twice and that's it it's a good fit inside the prop and of course uh, this one now slides in be careful the slots and just clicks in Now we can just wipe the inside of this thing just to make sure we got all the old grease out. And we wipe this one as well. And then we can add some 24C onto it. There, so I put a little 24C. We then slide it in. It clicks into place, and then we slide the whole thing onto the prop shaft. And that you can see. Mind. Now we have just two more pieces left, which is this nut and this is the locking mechanism so this slides in here and we want three of these to engage and this is the nut so add a little more
some lubrication. And then we take a 1 and 1 16th socket which fits this nut. I slide the nut on. Remember to just use your hand for now and eventually you'll put a wooden block in to block the prop from turning once we actually tighten it. We get our wooden block and make sure it's wood so it doesn't damage the prop. Once it appears to be tight enough, take it out. And replace it with a torque wrench. And this is my torque wrench. I make sure that it's 55 foot pounds of torque. And you can see it's going 40, 50. One more, do it. And that gives 55 pounds of torque. Cut it off. 
Okay, so now what we have to do is find three tabs. So we got one here, got one maybe here, and then you got one here. So we just um, basically just use a pair of pliers and tap it in gently. So that's one in. That's two. And that's three. So we've got three tabs in. And we can push some of these back as well. Just making them look a little bit neater. And then that should resist turning. So that's it, that's how to change a prop on a command thrust gearbox, which is, I mean, a command thrust gear case, which is the same as um, larger motors like the 75 and the 110.